This is the raw material for the paper orchestra. We put together this three-dimensional three-dimensional uh, paper violin with the parents. Uh, we use papier mache, and then we keep adding all the parts of the violin so the kids know the uh, learn the, the parts like the the, the bottom, the uh, the chin rest, the uh, fingerboard, the strings. We keep the, adding them week by week so they they learn it. They learn the parts of the violin, they, they learn what they are for, they learn all the postures and positions and all the basics in order to, when we give them the instruments, we can start right away teaching them how to make sound rather than just the boring part of this is how you hold the violin and this is how you stand. And it's usually it's very frustrating for the kids to receive this beautiful instrument and, and they cannot play it for about two months because they have to learn how to hold it, how to be careful. So this is a great tool. It came out of necessity in Venezuela. They didn't have the instruments on time. They recruited a lot of kids for an orchestra. They knew the instruments were coming because they had the money, but because of all the bureaucracy or whatever, they didn't receive the instruments on time. So they, they as an emergency, they called the parents and asked them to build paper instruments.